Hi everybody, welcome to Big Oggy Golf. Welcome to a new Cornish Quest video. Indeed. The uh, sun is shining, sorry, it's a little bit low sun. Yeah. Because it's very early in the morning. It's, uh, well, seven? Seven, half seven. Half seven now. Yeah. We've got a half seven tea time. We are at the point at Poles F. The point Poles F. It's gonna be a fantastic day. I haven't played here for about five years on the channel. I was here with Smithy last time, yeah. remember rightly. Now I'm here with Neil. Uh, Neil's not played it before. No. But it's going to be a great, great course. They've got a, since I've played here last, they've got a change of one of their par threes. So, very interesting. Point Pulls F, very quickly, because we're going to crack on fast, is uh, it's a beautiful course. It's got accommodation. They've got almost like a ledger centre here yeah. as well, uh, with a swimming. They've got paddle tennis. Yeah. We've seen uh, lots of things here. It's two miles from St Anadoc, they won't mind saying that, it's on our website. It's just down the road from Travaux. it's not very far from Wavebridge, therefore it's not very far from Bude. No. It's a fantastic location, come and stay here, use it as a base. Brilliant course, some of the best greens around, so people say, we're going to go and find out. We're going to play scramble today, yep. because, well, Neil's still playing very well, I'm still recovering from a slip disc, so basically it's a Neil solo round with me adding a little bit of a shots here and there okay six holes in this video six holes in the second six holes in the third we're going to crack on hole number one right neil we're into the low morning sun my friend we are indeed we've got first hole here 424 yard par five par five yeah quite nice um so i've been a long time since i've played this course but it's pretty much straight out there's a, a kind of pathway a little roadway yeah. along the middle Looks good. Bunkers all over the place, mate. Looks nice. You just get it out there. Has to be fit, sorry, channel. We haven't warmed up, so this could go anywhere. I'm going to have to trust you because I can't see into that sun. The left is in the rough up there, but yep. should be alright. Really good course, really good course. I'd say it's just a shame logistically we tried to come back, then Covid and then weather and all these other kind of things just stopped us from getting back yeah, here. There's been a lot stopping us. Well, it's out there, but it's going to swing right, and I'm not going to worry because that's what you're here for today. <laughs> ah. Yeah, that's alright. Let's crack on. Well, mate, a bit worse tee shots, but well, you're in the light rough, I guess, but it's okay. Yeah. We're uh, 225 away. Okay. Just kind of get it out there still. As long as it's right and left. I mean, it's, it's a par five. Yep. Do you know what? It's a scramble, it's a par five. Well, it's a scramble, yeah. You know. Just remember, oh. normally you've got more than one other person with a bad back helping you out there. No, we'll be all right. Right. Right up the hill. That looked pretty good. Bit to the right maybe, but a bit straight. You were aiming a bit right. I lost that one in the air, but yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's going to be a bit tricky with the low sun at the moment. Yeah. Just uh, seeing where things are going. Well, it's kind of gone. Yeah, right the yours corner, is just going up that right. left hand side well. there. We'll go and see what's best. Left of that bunker. Yeah. So, Neil's just going to get my ball, which ended up in the bunker, which would have been okay, but not the best shot for a scramble. And anyway, we found Neil's. Oh, he's playing so well right now. So, um, I believe he played at West Cornwall yesterday got thrown into a comp at the last minute and uh, did okay. Certainly for the first number of holes with lots of pars. We shall see today. So as it's just two of us today, we're running and gunning with the one camera. So I'm sorry yeah. if you're not getting all the bells and whistles today. Well. Um, but it's an early morning and a lovely opportunity to get out and play the point. We've done well, we're up here just next to the green, so. What are you taking, Neil? Well, I've got my little 60, just to bump it on. Okay. I don't know what the greens are like. I've not played here before. Oh. A little bumper probably could have done a bit more, but it's that certainly was... moving. 
That was definitely a uh, early morning start. Early morning, early yeah. morning shot, right? Well, oh, fuck. So, I would have normally gone dinky nine here, but there is a bit of a... Yeah, you've got a bit to go over. Yeah, so I'm going to go 50 wedge, as I still don't have a 54 anymore. Oh, I do, I think I've put a Mizuno in my old one. Oh, you got your old one, yeah. yeah. So, anyway, I digress. Not the best start, mate. We'll be right. I know. <laughs> I don't really care what wedge I got at the moment, because it ain't going to go well. So, no, I'm sorry I've, I've not restarted hot, but we'll get better as That's the right. pinkers kick in. Wasn't my best chip, but it's a par five. We're here for three. Yep. I'm here for the putting, so they say. Hmm, <laughs> we'll see. Right. Very good, I might not need be needed. Oh, oh. well done. Well, that'll do. Quite like that. I think that's very good. Within what six inches? About, about a foot. Oh, a foot. Well, what do I know about size? No, well, we're both there and thereabouts, mate. Wow, tap him in. in, tap him in. Well done. A so, par to start. A par to start. That's okay. Nice, steady. Yeah. Potting was okay. Never played here before, so I'm, I'm happy with that. The, the greens are very pure here. They look really good. Yeah. yeah. Like a carpet, isn't it? Yeah. Let's go on to hole number two. Let's go. Right, Lanil. Again, we're still into the sun in this direction. Yeah. So, second. Yep. Uh, 370. Yard par four. You're just checking Sorry, the just little, checking the little side beside you. This looks quite nice. Going straight down. Two, two bunkers down the right. Yep, bunkers on the left by the green. A bit later. Yeah. I think there's a little bit of a slight slope. Looks like it from those bunkers on the right down to the bank greener to the right side bank. Yeah. Well, let's get it down there. Okay. That hooked a bit right to left, mate. That's somewhere down by those bushes on the left. I didn't see it. No, it's just it's swept out and curled that way. Yeah, I, I didn't see it. I love the sun, really. <laughs> just don't want it so low. What have been a couple of people got on the course about? I was here about seven o'clock, and they were out on the course already. Yeah, getting some holes in before work. But whether they'll see them after where they're balling. Better. Yeah, that's a good that's one. That's what I'm here for. I've towards that first bunker, but dead straight. Yeah, that's fine. I'm here to sort out when Neil makes a mistake like that. So, Neil, we've taken mine because you had a quick look over there, but to be honest, you weren't going to find it. No. You swept down over on the left. Uh, mine's obviously not as long as Neil would have been, but that's fine. I aim for these bunkers. Come up just short. Just on the right-hand side. Yeah, just off the raft there. Yeah, it'll be fine. Those uh, bunkers, they look like they're the GUR at the moment. There's a lot of work on them. Yeah, we were speaking to the golf manager. Rubber, rubber grinding. Yeah, you can see that in them. We'll yeah. show a picture of that in a minute. It looks really good. Just to make them playable all year round. So Im Improvements happening to this course oh, all the time. Definitely. Fantastic place. They've invested a lot of money. They've got new irrigation system on the greens. Honestly, the greenkeeper I spoke to earlier is very proud of this place. Very proud of the work. I'm very proud of Ali. They turned this place around. Right, I'll move back a bit, Neil, because you'll live it. A bit higher than me. So I'm going to go five arm. You yeah. reckon we're about? It's about 190. 190, yeah. I'm just going to get a bit further up for you. That's my plan. I think we're on, Neil. I think I've hit the right button. Yeah, we're rolling. We're, we're rolling. Early days for me today. I'm on heavy meds. So, yeah, took it out the rough. Yes. Down the left, but hopefully Neil will be Neil will be correcting that. Well, if there's anything that's from the tee shot, I well, I tell him only here to fix your mistake. Same is I got to go first that time. All right, 
Get it out there. Yeah, that kind of happened to me. When I pulled back, it did, the, the rough just grabbed the club and it yeah. backed a bit. We didn't help that I dropped it just at front of your divot, so uh, just snagged. But it's, up there? it's just up there short of the green. Okay. Neil, yes. we're, we're on the second, mate. Thanks for finding my ball. That's right. Uh, that's the second time now that Neil has actually run over my ball with the buggy. I know. He's, he's not the greatest driver. Driving into the sun, you, you just can't see the balls. Can't see a thing. Uh, but we're up near the green and that's all we need to be. We're here with my ball. Well done. So Neil, welcome to my world. Welcome to the world where it only takes a couple of shots and you're still short of the green. Yeah, we've got 67 yards to go. Okay. Uh, pins on that sort of back left. It is. Don't look at the bunkers, they don't exist. It was YouTube short I watched the other day. Yeah. <laughs> Just hit a better shot, didn't it? Yeah. Won't see that on a shot tracer, but it'll come down. That looked very nice. That should be right. Yeah, lovely. Not massively close, but well, it's about? on the green. Yeah, you're well, on the green as well. You're probably a little bit closer. Yeah, I'm a little bit closer, but that's okay. Let's get up there. Let's see what we can salvage. Right, Neil. So, how far have we got? Go about 15 feet. Yeah, about 15 feet down the hill. Bit of a slope as well. Yeah, it's not. It's probably. Well, it'd be great if we got a par, but I think yeah. we've got to salvage the shot here. It's running so well, though, aren't they? Look at that. Go on. Oh, oh, I wish I'd seen the line. Oh well, hard to do in the camera, mate. Literally, at my ball. That is the line, at my ball. At your ball? Yeah. Well, to be, to be honest, do you want to mark that? No, there's a thing. But what happens if I actually, well, I won't, but it just happens if I hit that and it pops it in. Well, if we're playing true rules. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> just wondering. Yeah, we'd, we'd get a penalty, but. Oh, would we? Oh, well, it's a shame. Yeah, I've gone the other way, so I'm worried about it, but yeah. Okay. Right, we'll That'd finish this one in. Yeah. Well done. So, we'll take a five. Bit of damage limitation, but that's okay. Yeah. On to hole number three. Oh, these, these greens, they're just like carpet. I know, uh, they're, they're really good. Oh, yeah, cheers, mate. I'll, I'll give you all your tees because I'm going to be come collecting them already. Two holes. Yeah, two two holes, four tees. I've already got. I'm doing well. Because you're nice, I'll give you them back. Thanks. So, Thanks. hole number three. 378 yard par four. Okay. Going back parallel to where we've just come up. Yeah. We've got a bunker left. I don't think there's going to be any issues. Bunker on the right might be in your play. Um, but yeah, but it looks like there's a road going through the I think middle. It's the same road, yeah, it'll probably get the cross. Or a little ditch or something, but. And there'll be bunkers up on the left when you get near the green. Slightly moving left to right on the fairway. I think so. I think the bunkers up near the green are the line. Well, that would be the plan. Getting another good one away. Oh, well, that's dead straight left. All right. Yeah. Left of that left bunker. Forgive the slightly garbled talking. I had a mouthful of green tea in my hand. Huh. No? Mouthful of tea in my hand. Mouthful, mouthful of, tea. of tea. That's what. Could have been a cup. I don't mean a mouthful of tea. I meant one of them. Yes, I'm up left by that wall up there. Not the yeah. best strike in the world, but. So you kind of towards that first line of bunkers, weren't you? But it went straight. Yeah. Struggling to warm up today. What you're in shorts, mate. I mean. I know. It's summer. I do apologise in advance to everyone who's watching for me in shorts. <laughs> Yeah, there's a lot of pasty legs out there, a lot of good golf YouTube channels right there. Oh yeah. That's included. Beautiful. Great. Straight up the middle. Straight in the middle, bouncing along. If only you needed me. So you're in the middle of the fairway, I'm left in the rough. Yep. See what happens. See. So Neil, we took your shot, which is... Uh, just over on the left hand side. Neil don't think it was his best shot, but hey, no. it's further than mine, even though mine was bang smack in the centre of the fairway. I'm yeah. 
I wasn't oh, well, the best sure. driver. Right? 149 to go. Yep. Yeah. Remember, I'm here to just fix the odd mistake from Neil today, hopefully. <laughs> Probably like that. Mm. <laughs> it happens, right? Can't really say much about that, can you? Not, I wouldn't know anything about it, no. Um, I won't be officially dropping very well because um, if my back are not going to bend that many off time, but we'll give it a go. Right. So I'm going to try and get a bit further than that. Yeah, just anything further than that would be great. <laughs> anything further than that. I can't guarantee that either at the moment, mate. Oh, that's what they did say. It's quite tricky stuff to get out of, it's even if it's quite rough. They are right. Yeah, it's, it's, straight away, doesn't it? Yeah, it's but a stuff. I've got your bit close, yeah, yeah. isn't it? You're better than me. So, Neil just had a little look up to see what the green's like. Yeah. Can't see any bunkers there, right? So, okay. we're all right. Oh, a bit thin. Oh, oh the five barriers is right. Sorry about that, mate. It wasn't too bad for the length. Yeah, I tried to go back for the height, but I still can't get as high as you. Oh. That look, that looks superb. Fired it straight through. We'll, we'll see. We'll see what's happened. Gone past. Gone through. Oh no, Neil done his usual. Get it over the back. So strangely enough, we're probably about similar distances. Mine was here over on the side here, but it's got more of a bump. This is a slightly raised green. So we're going for Nils. Uh, he's got slightly less of a raised area to just get over. You'll see me in a minute, but we're on a shotgun mic today, so you won't be a lot of chat from that end. Lovely, lovely. Damage limitation, might have to Just rolled away. Just rolled away, yep. Okay. Alright. Well done. Well done. Good finish. So we dropped another shot against the course. Yeah. So, so we're two over. Two over. It's, uh, hole number four to, to come. Let's get to the fourth hole. The hoodie's going to have to come off. It's getting uh, a bit I think hot. so. But Someone did ask a question the other day. Why does he wear a hoodie when he's never going to put the other up on a golf course? Simple. I wear this to and fro the course. And I wear hoodies in my home life. So, you know. Well, on, just... Be honest. You actually said the other day, because it looks cool. It looks cool. <laughs> you know. But well, well trained to you are, Neil. Yeah. Right then, now after our little hoodie discussion, yeah. uh, we're on hole number four. We are indeed, 319 yard par four. Yep. Um, slightly downhill by look of it. Slightly kinking left to right, bunker there. Kinking yeah, bunker right in front of the out, green, yep. I'll move his round for shot tracer. Oh, you've done it again. That's a tree, Neil. That's a tree. Oh, look at that. No, no. No, no. I'm down here. Is that the old four? Daddy the old four. Honestly, it's like, it's like dealing with a small child. Well, I say small. That's one of your four to ones. There you go. Oh, cheers, thanks. All right, I'll, I'll use the own tree. All right. <laughs> Can I get another one? I'm going to have to count how many I take out versus how many I bring back. I've given you them all back so far. It's a bit big and a bit high. But it's going to land in play. Yeah. I think yours is going to be a better bet than mine. Well, they're not great, but they are in play. Well, 
we were actually similar distance because yours hit the tree which is a bit embarrassing for me as well but and it did actually come out but it was in heavier rough yeah so we're 195 yeah still a long way sorry about that yeah, so we've still got a fair way to go john yeah it's just getting it for me it's just getting it further down there for you it's kind of getting it close I found a bush, mate. You found a bush? I actually heard it hit the wall or a bush or a trunk. <laughs> yeah. Right, you can... That's how it fix every shot. That's the shot no. we needed. No. It's got to go a little bit right. Oh, I don't know. No, it's not bad, mate. Just a little bit short of the green again. Yeah, not the, not the best shot, but... Poor old Neil. He's a little bit disheartened right now. This is what golf is. Golf is humbling. But you'll come back. That was a good shot, mate. You you don't think that is, but I think that's a great yeah, shot. I think the past, past couple of times I've played golf has been quite good, but this, this happens. Something for Buggy Cam. So, welcome back to Buggy Cam. Oh, yeah. oh Neil, Neil took the break off. Uh, so, what are you saying there, Neil? What's, well, what's past, the, the past couple of times I've played golf, it, it, golf is one of those games you can play really well, and the next day you come out. And it's just it's not there, just isn't not it? It's there, yeah. It's strange because I mean, we had a great time at St. Orsall, hitting the ball quite well. I played the competition uh, Wednesday this week. Scored, okay. uh, did, did all right, didn't do too bad. And today, there's it's nothing just, there. It's just not there. It's nothing it, there today. It'll happen, early morning, you never know. Um, but we're, yeah, we're kind of there and thereabouts. Obviously, in a scramble, you'd like to be better than this. But remember, you've got a high handicapper with you. It's basically you and just a bit of me. Yeah, that's all. It's fine. The, don't think you're going to find my ball, though it did whack pretty heavily into a bit of a trunk or a bush. I love going round in circles. Going round in circles. So we put a little like roundabout music on as we we'll go around. A, we'll have a little look, shall we? Yeah, but yours is down near the green. Well, it's just well, damage well, limitation, isn't it, for every time for us right now? That's right. You'll get there. Again, come up a little bit short. Yeah, a little bit short on the old, short on the green, but... Well, we'll just get it on. The uh, flag is quite near the front, so we don't have a lot of green to work no. with. But um, if we can try to salvage pie, I don't want to give another shot away. No, no. Let's crack on. Right. I'm going to move back a bit. Neil will go with a lofted. I know you're um, sorry about that. He trusts Neil to put the uh, his club on the tripod. He's going, no, oh, no, he's got the hand. Grip's wet now. Could be nice. Oh, a little kick there. Oh, a little kick, but it's all right. That's possible. That's possible. It's possible. Sorry, I've got your grip all wet. That's all right. I was just trying to keep it dry. I'm going to have my, my grip's going to be wet. Would you like to not make my grip wet? I wouldn't like to have a wet grip, honestly. All right. Thank yeah. I haven't just thrown it on the floor. <laughs> Still got it in my hand. A little dinky nine. I think that's the shot. Oh, didn't think about it. A bit fiery. Yeah. Well, I've got a bit of a decision. Well, I think we'll get it for yours because it's closer. Yeah. It's been alright. Yeah, it's fired oh. out a little bit. Early morning. Is it eight o'clock yet? Yeah. Probably not. It's, it's half eight. What oh, is it? We've been here an hour. Feels like it's been quicker. Well, we didn't quite make the green. No, there's a, it just snags up the rough here. It's really I, I, Every coarse. time you just slightly move it back. I know yeah. people say I'm repeating myself, but that's literally what's happening every time. That's a good course. I'm watching that one. That was the right line, I think, but it just died on you. Yeah, it's just not quite enough juice. Okay. Race it on. Race on. I'll well, have to go for a bit more than you. So we'll finish it off. Yeah. Well done. So, another shot dropped. Kind of. Well, yes, it is. 
Um, what three, are you going to say? Three, three over. Better start chasing some birdies, right? Yeah. Let's, let's start chasing something, shall we? Well, go chase something. I know. We've got 157 to the pin. Yep. A 148 yard hole. I presume they measure that straight to the centre. If you get frustrated again, mate, I'm going to get you to sit down on that naughty seat over there. Honestly, I am. Naughty we'll, nil. We'll try not to. So let's move this back so you can try and get some kind of shot tracer on this. I was doing a bit of B-roll footage, so what happened? Just gone right in the green. Right in the green? Wasn't wasn't amazing. Uh, oh well. I don't know what you expect me to do. Well, I'll put it on the green. <laughs> right, well, I might right, John. Just plop oh, yeah. it down there. I just realised I did that lesson. I've not done any of that little move. Well, get, get, come on, you Elvis. Go, you go straight back into your old game, don't you? Without even thinking about oh, yeah. it. Yeah, come on, Elvis. Get those hips working. <laughs> yeah. Well, in my back, I'm not sure if I got any hips. Right. Yeah, better strike. Yeah, I aimed for that kind of bunker and it didn't strike. And you've got you've got in the bunker, so yeah, well I aimed for the bunker, I wasn't expecting to go that far. So my my one way right was yeah. gonna be the ball. Should be. Let's get down there. Well, I aimed for the bunker, not expecting it to kind of go dead straight. And that's where it happened. So we're taking Nils, which is just over the back on the right hand side. Long and right. It'll be fine. Yeah, uh, sorry everyone, I've, I've just been forgetting that I need to move those hips. It's funny, you have a lesson and then you play a couple of rounds, everything's going all right, then you come out again a few days later, a week later, and it's just gone from your head. It takes a few holes to suddenly realise what you should be doing. Better strike though. Okay, well, we'll see when we get down this bit. Let's get a par again. Get a par, yeah, yeah. Hey, right now, a par is confidence. <laughs> ah, hang on. I'll be here, Neil. I fixed it, Neil. You fixed it. I could see me losing a club somewhere today. <laughs> Neil, the club thrower. In a never, never seen before. Um, I used to be discus champion for my school and county. Um, do you fancy? learning how to like lob properly well, pop I think we'll have, to, yeah. uh, we'll have to talk technique although <laughs> the way it's building at the moment it could be going quite far yeah should we get on to the next we will we're at the one nil we're on uh, hole number six last video on this part of the uh, yeah. series 508 yard par five yep i'm relying on you my friend to get a I, decent I drive going. Straight out marker. marker post, please. That'll be good. Anywhere near that on the fairway would be good. I mean, at the moment, it could go anywhere. Well, yes. <laughs> We're not going to lie. No, I'm not going to lie. It, people have seen the last five holes. No, that's where. That's why I brought you for that shot. Hit about the right, but it went a long way. Well done. We carry on. I'm not going to hit a drive. Well, let's hope that's in the fairway. Well done. So we believe that we haven't played it before, but we're pretty sure you have to hit over that bunker. Yeah, there's a marker stick at the back. Um, the pin's just slightly to the left of that. It's about 185. Okay. I've had to load it up on GF GPS. Downhill, so I've taken a couple of clubs less. Yep. The only problem with a rangefinder if you can't see a flag. That is the only downside. So, you know, it's, as much as I love rangefinders, I do also sometimes have a GPS. Right. Just for that shot. Looks very good. This could be the Neil show, this one, to be honest. Oh, just over that bunker. It's all down to length, that. Yes. So, I didn't take a shot there because, well, I don't think I was going to get as good as what Neil did anyway. And I'm just going to rest my back a little bit. To be fair, I, I, didn't really, I was just judging off distance and line, but... I'm happy with that there, good, it's, it's a par 5, we're, we're close to the green. Yep. Let me just turn this round to show you. 
Yeah, so the marker was actually where the flag was. Yeah. Yeah. Put this down on the ground. Alright. Bit of a slope. As you'll be able to tell from this position. I'll turn it straight for you. There we go. Could be nice, mate. Oh, I just sat on the first bounce. Not bad, though. Not bad. But it's there or thereabouts. Yeah, that's within, what, 10 feet for a, a birdie. Which is what we need. I can't see where you put it. Uh, uh, Forward, 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 left, 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 forward, 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 right, stop. White, white tea, Monk Days is not that, but, <laughs> you know. Yeah, that's very good, mate, well done. Mm, I just snagged up in that cut, but... Yeah. That's okay. It's alright, I see we've got a birdie putt. Yeah. Right, Neil, so yet again, that defeats what we normally do on the yeah. scramble. It's not, a, quite a long putt again. Not as close as I thought it was, but no. it's a chance for birdie. Never came out at all. It didn't move. No. Didn't move. If you go line in between my ball and the pin. We got a par. We got a par. So, thank you very much to the Point Poles there for allowing us to come and film today. These greens are they're amazing. They are on they're very point, good. aren't they? Hopefully we'll get some decent putting in the next few holes. Hopefully we'll get some decent golf in the next few holes. Well, there'll be little, little bits and pieces, yeah. but it's an early morning start as befits. It is, yeah, I mean, what, nine o'clock. Yeah, by now. Should we power on? We're going to power on. Please come watch series number two of this and uh, obviously the series number three of this. Series, video, one of those. Please, please come two. and watch. Part three. That's the ones. And we'll see you in part two. Don't forget to subscribe. Please do. And click a like. Yeah. The more you more subscribers you get, the better golf will play. Honestly, true. I'd like to think that's true. <laughs> Don't tell them. <laughs> <laughs>